Victory is ours! If I hadn't been here, you'd never have survived. My father would have ensured a more decisive victory. But he's not here. Oh, we have you to thank for that, if I recall. Uh, don't start. Don't you dare tell me what to do. I am in command here. You needed my help. By the gods, how are you so arrogant? No wonder my father discarded you. You know nothing about my family. I know he threw you off of a cliff and chose me instead. Oh, now who's being arrogant? You were an afterthought. You were a second place. We'll see about that. What do you mean? Now that we've driven the Athenians from the field, it's time I dealt with my true enemy. Stentor, you... Your job is done, mercenary. Now I will kill you for what you stole from me in Megaris. Why are you doing this? Because... Because you marched into Megaris, ruined the fucking war, and murdered my father! I did what I had to! And so will I! You don't have to do this, Stentor. Oh, but I do. There is nothing you can say to convince me otherwise. This isn't what Nikolaos would have wanted. Oh, you fucking know. Traitor. I am not a traitor. You betrayed Sparta. You betrayed your family. You killed my father and stole my chance at a normal life. You deserve nothing but the cold of my blade buried in your heart. Killing each other will not heal the wounds of the past. Pater! Hello, Centaur. I thought you were dead. Not just yet. He should pay for what he's done! How many times do I have to tell you? Centaur. He owes me nothing. I don't understand. You both have a greater role to play. Become the leader I trained you to be. Lead the armies of Sparta and be victorious. How? You are an honorable man, a loyal son, and a great warrior. You will be a better commander than I ever was. You can do this. I will, father. I will make you proud. You already have. That could have ended badly. Alexios, a shadow grows across Sparta. Be cautious when you return. Mater and I will deal with it. You found her? Ruling Naxos. Sounds like her. <laughs> May the gods watch over you both.
Come on. Don't want to be caught here. Come on. Easy now. Ella. Come on. mentioned the lair of the sphinx impressive oh my amistios what are you doing here my name is gorgias and i have spent my life researching the past of Viotia and the peloponnese i'm looking for the other half of this amulet ah yes i know of items like this i was seeking a piece similar in size where is it Unfortunately, my apprentice was the one tracking down its final location in Locris. He went to retrieve it, but never returned. I'll find your apprentice and recover the amulet piece without any trouble at all. Thank you. The gods have truly blessed me by sending you to help find Pivos. What was Pivos looking for? There was a cave discovered that might contain items of great significance. I sent him to validate the claims before I made the journey myself. Where was your apprentice heading? We heard rumors of a sighting near the tomb of Menikefs in Viotia. Don't worry. I'll find out what happened to Pibos. over there.
creature that killed Pibos must have eaten the amulet. Can I help you with anything? The midwife from the village usually comes for plants I grow for her pharmaca, but she's very late. Do you think something has happened to her? I hope not, but she usually comes up through the barley field. I did see a wolf running through there the other day. Let me guess, you want me to kill the wolf? That's right. It can't live. I don't have time for this right now. Come back if you change your mind. <laughs> Easy. Off we go. <laughs> you it's gone it must only it must only it must only work at night I should come back after dark it must only work at night I should come back after dark Another challenger. I hope you're more resilient than the last one. By the gods! This statue came alive! I am no statue, child. If you cannot comprehend what stands before you, how are you to entertain me? What are you? The Sphinx. The guardian of truth and knowledge. Why are you here? The gods sent me to protect something. And I've been its guardian ever since. I came here for another reason. Oh, then tell me, little one. Why are you here? You protect an object of great power. I have been asked to return it to where it belongs. A most noble of causes. Sadly, I cannot grant your request. There's too much at stake. I won't leave without it. The power I guard is not for the weak-willed. I can resist. 
One must risk everything in the pursuit of knowledge. If you can answer my questions wisely, you will have proven yourself worthy. In spring I am gay in handsome array. In summer more clothing I wear. When colder it grows, I fling off my clothes. And in winter quite naked appear. You're a mountain. Only time will tell. Never resting, never still. Moving silently from hill to hill. It does not walk, run, or trot. All is cool where it is not. The wind. You do amuse me. Some try to hide, some try to cheat. But time will show. We always will meet. Try as you might to guess my name. Promise you know when you I do claim. Time. A keen mind. You are an interesting one. Now take what you have learned and touch the symbols that reflect your choices. Like those who came before, you have failed. Statue. It's gone. Another challenger. By the gods. I am no statue. I came here for another reason. Oh, then tell me, little one, why are you here? You protect an object of great power. I have been asked to return it to where it belongs. A most noble of causes. Sadly, I cannot grant your request. There's too much at stake. I won't leave without it. The power I guard is not for the weak-willed. I can resist. One must risk everything in the pursuit of knowledge. If you can answer my questions wisely, you will have proven yourself worthy. Some try to hide, some try to cheat. But time will show, we always will meet. Try as you might to guess my name. I promise you'll know when you I do claim. Death. Well done, mortal. In spring I am gay in handsome array. In summer more clothing I wear. When colder it grows, I fling off my clothes, and in winter quite naked appear. You're a tree. Impressive, little one. Most impressive. As small as your thumb, I am light in the air. You may hear me before you see me, but trust that I'm there. A hummingbird. Hmm. How clever you are. You are an interesting one. Now, take what you have learned and touch the symbols that reflect your choices.
απολαμβάνει η χώρα. Spartans can build as many boats as they like, but Poseidon will never favor them as he does the Athenians. Best stay out of sight. You're new. If it's training you want, we don't just take anyone. Do I look like I need training? I was sent by King Pausanias to collect the Pankration champion. My apologies. I didn't realize you were here for testicles. Don't worry about it. I don't exactly look the part. If I may offer some advice before you get him, testicles can be... difficult. A gift of oil is known to put a person on his good side. Oil? A muscle rub. He believes it imbues him with the power of Heracles. Look in the village of Githion. His favorite merchant is there. Where can I find your champion? I sent Testicles to train on a small island in the Bay of Hades. It's good for him there, isolated, away from people. Look for the shipwreck of Nestor on the southern shore. Can you tell me anything about Pankratio? It's a mix of boxing and wrestling, a fearsome test of skill. Champions come from the farthest corners of the world to compete in Olympia, but not all walk away. 
I can't wait to see it. Winning the wreath is important for Sparta. You think he can do it? The other day he knocked out six men and a bull. And he only went to the market to buy fruit. That's why I had to send him to the island. I need to get this champion of yours to Elise. I hope he lives up to your promise. Oh, he will. Look for his camp on the southernmost island in Messinia. Good luck. I should get that oil. Anything that will make it easier to get testicles to the Olympics. Where we go? Off we go now. I see her. Come on! Gala! Huh? <sighs> Another slow day. <sighs> Sorry, closed. I need oil, then I'll be on my way. There's a special one that uh, Testicles uses. Ah, for Pankration fighters. That one has to be made fresh by the Master, and he's gone. I'm not leaving without it. You don't understand. I'm nearly free. You're a slave? Yes, and in a good position. Doing this would be stealing from him. If it's a question of Dragmi, I can pay you for the oil. It's a question of trust. I know my master. He's kind, but strict. My freedom depends on it. I know I'm asking for a lot, but I need this oil now. I could come back and talk to your master, maybe explain the situation. What choice do I have? It's not bad, this life, if I have to stay. I'll give you the recipe, but that's as far as I go. You make it yourself. I can do that. Light a fire and gently heat oil of Athena to aid the infusion. When it's warm, just add a touch of cinnamon. Thank you. I hope it's worth my freedom. Let's see if I can get this right. 
It had to be heated. Now, what oil did I need? This one, the oil of Athena. I'll take some of this. Almost done. Now to add... For the final touch, a rose petal. Testicles will smell so good. I hope he appreciates this. Ah, oh, it smells so good. I almost want to keep it for myself. Champion, no less! Can't see the appeal. Everyone coming together peacefully in friendly competition rather than on a temple. You'd think they'd just kill each other like everywhere else. That's the magic of the Olympics. That must be testicles.
the bee could be useful. Get the oars out! More speed! Ready the ship for docking. <laughs> 